listen to the sentences. Decide what you would say in each situation using the multi-word verb prompts. 1. You look in the fridge and see there's no milk. What do you say? Run out of. We've run out of milk. 2. You arrive late for a meeting because you were delayed in a traffic jam. What do you say? Hold up. 'm sorry I'm late. I was held up in a traffic jam. Three. You want to know if your parents will come with you to the airport to say goodbye when you leave. What do you say to them? See off. Will you see me off at the airport? Four. Your friend is reading a letter, but the handwriting is not very clear. She asks you to try and read one of the words for her. You try, but you can't. What do you say? Make out. I'm sorry, I can't make it out. Five. You're talking to someone at a motorway restaurant. He tells you he's driving north. You want to know what his destination is. What do you say? Head for. Where are you heading for? Six. You're in a taxi and you want the driver to stop outside the bank. What do you say? Pull up. Can you pull up outside the bank, please? Seven. You're in your car on the motorway and it stops working. You phone a garage for help. What do you say? Break down. My car has broken down on the motorway. Can you help me, please? Eight. You want the driver of another car to move his car closer to the side of the road so that you can pass in your car. What do you say? Pull over. Can you pull over, please? Nine. You're in your friend's car and you see another car begin to move out in front of you. You want to warn your friend. What do you say? Pull out. Watch out! That car's going to pull out. Ten. You're in your friend's car and your friend isn't driving very carefully. You're frightened the journey will end with you both in hospital. What do you say? End up. If you don't drive more carefully, we'll end up in hospital. Here is the 7 o'clock news. First, the news headlines. 
Thieves break in at the Royal Gallery. Ship goes down at sea near the Sussex coast. Three men break out of Brixton prison. Plane comes down in jungle. Chemical factory blows up. Severe weather cuts off towns in the north. Damaged plane touches down safely. Now here is the news in detail. Last night, thieves broke into the Royal Gallery and got away with paintings worth over a quarter of a million pounds. The break-in happened around 11 o'clock in the evening, but was not discovered until the early hours of the morning. At present, it is not known how the thieves got into the building, though a security guard is helping the police with their inquiries. A ship has gone down at sea off the south coast of England following an explosion in its engine room. The ship was carrying a cargo of wood and was heading for Liverpool. The fire spread rapidly and was soon out of control. However, all the crew were picked up safely by the rescue services. Three men broke out of Brixton prison this morning. They overpowered a prison officer and escaped by climbing over the wall. They were seen making off in a red car that was waiting for them outside the prison. One of the men was later picked up by the police, but the other two men are still on the run. Police have warned the public not to approach these men, as they may be armed and dangerous. A plane with two English passengers on board has come down in dense jungle in Brazil. It seems that one of the engines cut out while the plane was heading for Rio de Janeiro and the pilot was forced to make a crash landing in the jungle. A rescue team is now searching for survivors. News is coming in of an explosion at a chemical processing plant in Luton. It seems that part of the factory blew up and a fire has broken out. Although the fire is dying down and the situation is under control, the fire brigades say they won't be able to put it out completely for several hours. Severe weather conditions in the north of England have cut off several towns and villages. Many roads are impassable due to heavy falls of snow. Supplies of food are being flown into some villages by helicopter. A plane had to make an emergency landing at Heathrow this morning when one of its doors blew off. Shortly after taking off, an explosion was heard and the plane had to turn back to Heathrow. The emergency services were standing by in case of a crash landing, but the plane touched down safely. I never want to go through an experience like that again, said the passenger, who had been sitting next to the door. I don't think I'll ever get over the shock of seeing the door come off and a drop of a thousand meters beneath me. Listen to the sentences. Then say the sentences again using the multi-word verb prompts. 1. The engine keeps stopping. Cut out. The engine keeps cutting out. 2. The survivors were rescued from the sea by helicopter. Pick up. The survivors were picked up by helicopter. Three. Don't touch it. It might explode. Blow up. Don't touch it. It might blow up. He was arrested by the police for possessing drugs. Pick up. He was picked up by the police for possessing drugs. Five. 
5. The police are ready for action in case there is trouble. Stand by. The police are standing by in case there is trouble. Six. Someone entered our house illegally at the weekend. Break into. Someone broke into our house at the weekend. Seven. Our village was isolated by a snowstorm for a week. Cut off. Our village was cut off by a snowstorm for a week. Eight. He's escaped from prison again. Break out. He's broken out of prison again. Nine. The robbers succeeded in stealing over a hundred thousand pounds. Get away with. The robbers got away with over a hundred thousand pounds. Ten. I tried to stop the thief, but he escaped on a motorbike. Make off. I tried to stop the thief, but he made off on a motorbike. Listen to the sentences. Then say the sentences again using the multi-word verb prompts. 1. The concert has been cancelled. Call off. The concert has been called off. 2. Stop criticising me all the time. Go on at. 3. Stop going on at me all the time. Three. He's invited her to the cinema. Ask out. He's asked her out to the cinema. Four. Julie is having a relationship with a man from France. Go out with. Julie is going out with a man from France. Five. He gives the impression of being rather aggressive. Come across as. He comes across as rather aggressive. Six. Their marriage has ended. Break up. Their marriage has broken up. Seven. Michael has had an argument with Tony and isn't talking to him. Fall out with. Michael has fallen out with Tony. Eight. I want to have a stable life, buy a house and get married. Settle down. I want to settle down. 
Nine. They have ended their relationship. Break off. They have broken off their relationship. Ten. I'm starting to dislike him. Go off. I'm starting to go off him. What's the matter, Jane? Have you fallen out with Paul again? Yes, you could say that. Well, it takes two to have an argument. What was it about this time? He said I was always going on at him. Is it true? Well, in a way, yes. But I was feeling insecure because I thought he was going off me. Oh. How long have you been going out with one another? Nearly a year now. But yesterday, I found out he's been going out with someone else. Oh, so what did you do? I told him. And he said he wanted to break off our relationship. But I thought you were planning to get married in June. We called it off. Oh, well, I'm sorry to hear the two of you have broken up. I think it will take me a long time to get over this. Well, perhaps it's for the best. You were never really happy with him. And after all, there are plenty more fish in the sea.